The DC cable is normally supplied pre-fitted with a connector. If, however, you need to fit one yourself, you will find full instructions in the installation manual, but the installation is actually quite simple. Begin by stripping 45 millimeters of outer insulation. Unplat the braid and divide it into two halves. Next we can remove the little piece of plastic and the string. Trim the two conductors to the correct length. The red conductor should be 38 millimeters and the black one should be 24. Thirty-eight. Now we have to strip 7 millimeters of insulation from both conductors. The object now is to crimp these connectors one onto each conductor and to do that we use a crimping tool. Start off by setting the selector switch here to the correct value for the cable. This is given in the manual, in our case it should be set to 6. When you put the pin on, make sure that there are no strands of wire sitting on the outside. Now we can insert the pin into the crimping tool and squeeze. We'll repeat this for the other terminal. Put the pin over the wire, it's all the way on. There are no strands of wire sticking outside. Put it into the tool and crimp. Next, we put these plastic grips or sleeves onto the back of the cable itself and fold the braid over in preparation for fitting the housing to the back of the connector. The two connectors should now be fitted into the actual connector itself. This is what will be connected to the equipment. But with the wider part of the D sub at the bottom, we must be sure of the polarity. This side is the negative or the black lead, this side is the positive or red lead. Now we insert the cables 
and clip them into position. They just push in. This stage we can now assemble the whole connector. We can present the housing. And see the connector fits here. Place the captive screw into the connector shell. and then fit the top half of the housing. Like this. As you can see, there are two lips of the housing, one either side that hold the connector in place. Hold everything together now using the screws. This completes the connector, it is terminated.